today we're here with Mrs. McLean about uh, Drama 7 and 8. Tell me, Mrs. McLean, what's your favorite part of teaching Drama 7 and 8? Or Drama 7, sorry. I love, in Drama 7, teaching um, all of the students. Last year I taught every single grade 7 student drama, and I loved getting to know them all, and, and drama class is kind of a different sort of uh, environment. So, um, you get to know them on a different kind of level than you would in a math class or an English class or something else, and uh, you get to help them sort of grow in a different kind of way. My favorite game is probably Hay Barn. Hay Barn? It's a good one. Yeah. What do you do in Hay Barn? You, <laughs> you go around a circle and you yeehaw and there's like different gestures, gestures to do and then like someone else had to carry on the, the flow. The flow. What I hope that you will learn from this class is um, when you're in grade 7, uh, confidence, speaking skills, uh, being able to work with other people, um, just building up your performance skills in general, and uh, a lot of that interpersonal stuff. Or you just start from where you are, and the aim is to build on your skills that you already have. Yeah. And what is your favorite project to do with the class every year? Uh, we do a lot of games in the class. We do games every day and one of my favorite things is a game where we uh, It's a setting game and then we create a mystery play based on the setting Yeah And Do you do any projects in front of parents or teachers or anything like that in grade 7? Right? My grade 7 classes we just create um, scenes and projects within the class and then we perform them that day or the next day for the people in the class. We don't uh, have any big productions or evening shows or um, occasionally I will videotape your scenes and then um, perhaps if you want you can show or I'm thinking about working with fresh grade but uh, we haven't got there yet, mostly it's just in class. 